Here's your daily update. Newsman Dennis Daly offers his take on the events of the day in another daily video blog. Hi and thanks again everybody. I guess you have seen that it has been raining like crazy here in the Los Angeles area and they tell us the worst may be yet to come. Now if you have never been to LA you really don't realize how many hills there are around here, some of them with very sharp sides. Now when you think about it, the Hollywood sign itself is on a hill. It is a long ridge that actually separates downtown Los Angeles from the San Fernando Valley in cities such as Burbank and North Hollywood. But there are other hills around here, and when you get a little farther out of town, there are mountains really tall ones in which there is a lot of skiing and winter sports activity. Some of those mountains have gotten feet and feet of snow. The problem is the skiers can't get there because the roads are impassable, which is the same situation today in Colorado. Overnight we are expecting a huge storm to begin to blow in off the Pacific. It is uh, kind of the grand finale, they are saying, of the storm we have now. They have already asked or ordered, I should say, 250 homes to be evacuated on the uh, lower part of ridges about oh, 35 miles northeast of downtown Los Angeles in what is called the La Canada Flint Ridge area. The problem is, whenever there are severe brush fires, those brush fires denude the hillside. So there's nothing there to hold the water and things start moving. Uh, the state of California has built a lot of what it calls debris basins to hold the junk that will come down with the water. A couple of those failed last time there was a big rain. But this is what they're calling the rain of biblical proportions and it should hit tomorrow morning at rush hour. <laughs> I'm going to get up early and listen to the radio. I'm Dennis Daly with your daily news update.